you, it makes you want to scream to the television when you're watching these kind of shows and these kind of stories. Today I have Luis Gerardo Mendez and Gabriela Cartol for Peacock's new show, The Resort. Thank you so much for being here. Thank, Thank you, Anna. So your characters are kind of at the heart of this mystery. And I know you can't really spoil what happens, but can you tell us a little bit about them and how we'll get to meet them as we kind of investigate? Of course. I think, um, yeah, as you, as you said, they are the keepers of all these secrets that happened in this hotel 15 years ago in the golden days of this resort and this paradise, no? And they they were part of that. And 15 years after that, after this horrible thing that happened and this hurricane destroyed everything, they are going to have a, a second chance to solve this mystery about what happened. But the interesting thing about this show is like, it's you never know what the show is really about. It's always changing. It's always mutating into something different. It, it's at the beginning, yeah, it, it looks like a comedy about this resort, but then it's more like a murder mystery. But wait a second, it has this magic element in it. So it's always transforming into something different. And uh, that's the kind of shows I love to watch. And uh, those are the kind of shows I like to be a part of because I, I, I think that, uh, you, it makes you want to scream to the television when you're watching these kind of shows and these kind of stories. Yeah, absolutely. I, I mean, watching the show, there's just so many layers. As you were filming it, did you know 100% what was going on or were you kind of like getting new scripts in and figuring it out? No, we're getting new scripts each time. And <laughs> Sometimes, every hour every yeah sometimes <laughs> every day every hour and also one of the things that i love about this show it's the exploration of human relationships and uh, in my case for me to have a partner in crime with balthazar i think it was one of of the most uh the things that i enjoyed the most as well to have this questioning about friendship about love about the past, about the present, and what you what you were and what you are now, and I, I just love that. Yeah, absolutely. I was going to say there are so many themes about the past and the present, and how they all kind of collide. In that, did you personally each take something kind of away from the script about that that you could share with us? Um, yeah, I guess um, I, I thought it was very interesting how. You never really know when you're living the golden days of your life, mm. you know, which is kind of sad and scary. Yeah. <laughs> but but there's also something very beautiful about being able to enjoy every stage of your life and taking these sec second chances to rediscover love, to rediscover uh, finding who you are, solving a mystery of I don't know, Baltasar is obsessed. My character is obsessed with these detective novels to the point that he wants to be a detective. And uh, I think there's, there's a pretty interesting about a pretty interesting thing about being a detective of your own life. You know, like being detective of your own mystery of why why are why why are you here in this in this world and like, what's your mission in this world? Like, and that's that's one of the questions that this character and this show is like throwing to the audience in a way. And I think that's. That's beautiful because it's also funny, you know, like when you have yeah. the chance to talk about these really deep topics with comedy, that's what I, that's when I jump, you know, as an actor and be like, yeah, I want to, I want to be a part of this. Yeah. What about you, Gabriela? Well, to me, it was how do you address love? Mm -hmm. And the conclusion is there isn't a right answer. Mm -hmm. Each one of us has their own journey. And also does this nostalgia of the past that it's never going to be the same, even if you go back. So there's no point in turning back, even though sometimes we just, we, we do, right? We, we do, we wish we, we could, um, but at the same time, to be able to enjoy the present, because this is actually what you have right now, and your life decisions that you have to make, you know, in order for you to, to continue in life as well. I think all these confrontations, I, I used to go like, we used to get into really, really deep conversations with police, with with Nick about about love, what what's what's the clue for someone to stay together so long, you know? Um, and also make me question myself: Am I in 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 my relationship, you know? And 
there isn't a right answer. I think, I guess it's a journey and it's like Noah and Emma. They're questioning also their, their marriage. And at the end of the day, they do compliment each other. Absolutely. Well, I, I, you're both are wonderful in the show. Uh, I can't wait for everyone to see it. Thank you so much for taking the time to talk with me. Thank you, Anna. Thank you so much.